Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. This is me, Fury. And before we jump into it, I just want to say subscribing, right? It's free, so why not? Uh, it's really going to help me out. Plus, if you guys subscribe, you're going to get daily updates of my videos. So, just keep that in mind when you go down there looking at that button, right? All right. So, you can see my diamond armor. I got some enchantments on there. Like the last couple episodes back, I said I wanted to get the protection for, which you see I got that on these. So, like, we're already off to a good start. There's still some more things we got to do to get to where we want. But that's not what today's episode is about. Last episode, you know, we got some villagers, right? And then we put one in here. So I didn't just put him in here just because I want to, like, trap him, right? He is going to have a job. And not only is he going to have a job, but a very important job. You see, this is the villager that's going to let us get mending books. And what mending is, is you can put it on your equipment, and anytime you get XP, say from, like, mining or killing something, whatever the case is, when you get the XP, it's going to repair your equipment. And like this awesome pickaxe we made. It, as you can tell, it's like, it's already wearing down. I mean, it's done a lot. It lasted a long time. But we need to repair that. And if we just put Mending on there, the only thing I have to do is mine with it. And it's going to stay full health forever. So, boom. Place that down. He should take the job, but he might try to take the other workstation up there. But if that happens... I'm just going to break his bed, put it back down, he hasn't taken it yet. So that's the one bad thing about the villager breeder being so close is like, it could mess with this. I might have to go up there and actually take the workstation down for him to forget the job, which I think instead of wasting time, I'm just going to go ahead and do that. So, Hang out right here, and I'm going to run up there and take that out. Alright guys, we're back, and now we have a librarian, huh? as you can see. So the thing we want to trade, we want huh? a level 1 trade, and we want it to be mending. And this is not mending. So, let's take your axe, yeah. chop that down, and... And replace it. Uh -huh. Take the job. His trades are different. And we don't know what that is, but we're not going to test it. Because once you trade, their trades are locked. Like, there's no turning back. So that's why we went on level 1 trade. See how many times uh -huh. it takes us to do, get this. Uh -huh. We'll say that was the second time. Huh? Three. Huh? 196. Oh, whoa, whoa, I almost skipped this. Here we are. It only took us 196 times. Wow. I feel like I must have got either really unlucky this time or really lucky every other time. Because it usually only takes me about like maybe 20, 20 tries. But what was this, 196? Oh my gosh, that was painful. <laughs> Alright, so now what we want to do is we want to lock this in. So I'm going to go grab some paper so I can trade with him to lock this in. So that way it doesn't change. Alright, so I traded on the paper, and I got 8 emeralds for what little bit of sugar can I had on hand. But, I have more. So let's see. Let's see how much paper, or how 